After many months of hard work day and night from the full moon of January until now, in the expectation of the entire mass of Thien Tun Fat Quang Pagoda, on May 28, 2023, the pagoda was officially completed the renovation of the head block of the statue of Buddha Shakyamuni. To fix the head block of the statue successfully, it has to go through many stages. The first is to create a clay figure from two years ago, by the master monk directly steering each stroke for the monks in the pagoda to do together. However, the shaping is not easy. So the master monk and the monks sometimes have to sit and look forever to find out where the error is and continue to correct it. Because, beauty only needs half a millimeter. A little bit up is ugly but the right is beautiful. And especially, all people have to put all minds and efforts and respect for the Buddha to create a shape, not simply a line, a stroke. Until the decision to repair the head block of the open-air Buddha statue with granite. The master and the monks had repaired the previous clay model more carefully during a month of hard work all day and night. The master and the monks covered every bit of soil, corrected each small line in a detailed and thorough manner. When the clay head block is finished, it is scanned into a computer into a 3D files and enlarged to the size of the existing exposed statue. After that, the monks cut out the 3D file in the computer to make a prototype. The bracket is made of mica resin to apply to the statue and cut, each must be accurate to the millimeter. Thanks to these molds, the sculptors will properly align to cut, not cut on precisely. But to fix the statue's face is not easy, it requires professional sculptors. Because, carving on stone requires sophistication, ingenuity, meticulousness and very high precision. So not everyone can fix the statue, because if the stone is cut wrongly, it will not be able to restore it. And in order to edit the head block of the statue to be the most accurate, the master has assigned the monks in each team to be in charge of each part of the Buddha's face such as eyes, nose, mouth, cheeks, forehead, hair. Closely follow each line, each stroke. Every detail carefully along with the sculptors when repairing the statue. This is an artistic statue, but it is a combination of science and technology and mathematics, not just art. Therefore, the monks also work very hard, day and night measuring, drawing each stroke and calculating each number accurately. There are hundreds of small square grids that the monks measure very precisely and draw on the face of the statue to both maintain the size, shape and make it easier for the artisans to carve. The restoration of the head block of the statue is extremely carefully prepared. The statue has a height of more than 14 meters, so before doing it, the workers must build a scaffolding around the statue safely and firmly. Then how much each position on the face is cut, how deep, are fitted with a laser machine to accurately measure the depth of each position to avoid errors, because it is impossible to restore the stone if it is cut wrongly. The first is 10 cm, 5 cm, 3 cm. Then 2 cm, be persistent and cut slowly deeper into the stone grain. With the Buddha's face, they had to cut several hundred molds, in each position, each angle. Each mold is carefully checked by the monks before it is applied to the statue to cut. Each mold sometimes has to be edited and re-edited dozens of times. Each lock of Buddha's hair is a work of art. Very beautiful, very soulful, lifelike. In addition, Master also directed to print a foam head block of the right size of the stone statue and place it next to it for comparison. To show the white general between the Buddha's eyebrows, the temple bought rose quartz jade. Because, rose quartz is a natural stone, so it will keep its beauty. Long-lasting and does not have to be replaced. The temple also buys jade to make Buddha's eyes. 
Because one of the 32 good signs, the 80 beauties of the Buddha are extremely magical blue eyes, in which solemnity is absolute, love and tolerance are absolute, and peace is absolute, wisdom is absolute. When the moment was about to attach the jade part to the Buddha's eyes, a brilliant halo of iridescent clouds appeared above the statue, making many witnesses excited and emotional, and had more faith and motivation to complete this century statue together. And when the temporary statue was finished, the master ordered to remove the surrounding scaffolding to observe many angles from afar and put the crane up for final editing. After making this statue, the artists and sculptors also expressed that they have learned a lot from the pagoda. They further understand that statue sculpting is not simply art, but it is a close combination of mathematics and art. Every detail is carefully calculated by the pagoda, measured every small point, the painter is very detailed, not based on the subjectivity of human thought, 